the newly released Blender 2.8 will be a massive game changer for all 3D modelers and animators, even if you're a complete beginner. In case you didn't know, Blender 2.8 is free, and it's also open source. That means you can make movies, games and art for free without having to spend a single dime. Blender can do pretty much everything from 3D modeling to animation, lighting, texturing, rendering and so on. It has world class tools that rivals the biggest 3D modeling and animation software out there. You know, the ones that they use in those big movie studios. Well, a new version of Blender just dropped recently and is fueled with so much stuff that even beginners can start making movies right now. So here are 5 reasons why Blender 2.8 is going to shake up the 3D industry. People used to hate Blender for its really unfriendly user interface. I mean, a few years ago, it resembled a rocket ship interface, and pressing the wrong button could cause an explosion. Not just for your computer, but for your brain as well. Well, it's not the case anymore. Blender 2.8 is so user friendly that you can pretty much get the gist of it within a few hours and after following some basic tutorials. The biggest win of all is that you no longer need to remember shortcut keys like you had to back in the day. Everything is now behind some kind of button or a function. Perhaps the only shortcut key to remember is F3. This brings up a search menu and allows you to find any function you need. Navigation is also super user friendly. There are widgets you can use to explore your Blender world easily. Blender 2.8 comes shipped with a bunch of new modeling widgets. Again, a big win from previous versions where you had to memorize shortcut keys to do pretty much the same thing. Now you can visually see right in front of you what you want to do with your 3D model just from the widgets. Then it's just a matter of selecting that mode and modeling away. Blender is already regarded by many users online as the best software for 3D modeling, even compared to commercial giants Maya and 3DS due to its fast and efficient workflow. Well, Blender 2.8 now brings that power to beginners. Bear in mind, these are world-class modeling tools you'd only find in expensive software, and it's all free. Blender used to be slow to render. I mean, really slow. A movie that I made two years ago took me 10 years to render out. Luckily, I didn't have to wait 10 years since I made use of render farms. But movies like Pixar's Toy Story 4 took around 60 to 160 hours to render a single frame of the movie. There are 24 frames per second in the movie. So doing the math, Pixar would have had to wait hundreds and hundreds of years rendering all day and all night just to finish the movie. But Pixar has access to huge render farms that help them to render it quicker. Generally speaking, rendering is known to be really slow across most 3D renderers available in the world. And Bender was no different. Its renderer, Cycles, is a physically based renderer, meaning it would help to mimic lighting and rendering as it would in the real world. Recently though, real-time renderers have become popular, and Blender 2.8 was pretty quick to make use of it by introducing a new built-in render engine called Eevee. You can now create almost photorealistic works in real-time, a massive time saver especially if you're looking to create quick visualizations or a continuous animated web series. Eevee achieves real-time rendering by doing a lot of fakery behind the scenes to help keep it performant. Light bounce calculations are not physically based as is with cycles, and a lot of shortcuts are taken. So if you don't really care about super photorealism and just want to start making awesome renders today, then Blender 2.8 can actually help you with that. Blender 2.8 is hands down much faster than its previous versions. Everything from the rendering to navigating the 3D software itself is a lot more fluid now. One of the biggest performance improvements in 2.8 is the integration of Open Subdiv. This is the same technology created by Pixar for their characters. This just means you can achieve super detailed looking 3D models and your PC should still remain performant with playing back animations without all that lagginess. Blender is perhaps the best free 3D software in the world. Well now, it's breaking into the 2D scene as well. With 2.8, you can now make 2D drawings and even 2D animations. The creators of Blender, the Blender Foundation team, have created a 2D animated film Hero just to prove that Blender can be used as a workable tool for 2D animations and it's not just a gimmick tool. 3D people will also have an easier time learning the 2D tools 
as it's seamlessly integrated with the 3D workflow as well. In addition to that, you can now mix 2D and 3D as well. So there is tremendous potential with this. And that's just scratching the surface of what Blender 2.8 can do. We didn't cover the other awesome features like physics and clothing improvements, the new hair and fur improvements, digital painting improvements, and so on. The ones we just covered are perhaps the most eagerly anticipated major changes that will surely cement Blender as one of the top free 3D software in the world. If you're interested in learning Blender 2.8 and want to use it for 3D modeling, go ahead and download the Blender 2.8 modeling cheat sheet. It gives you the most important 3D modeling functions you need to know and their shortcut keys. Print it out, stick it on your wall and have it right there beside you whenever you need it. Click the link in the description below to download it straight away. Thanks for watching.